This video is brought to you by myvayteaching.com. Let us describe the first process of producing wool, which is called shearing. The process of removing hair from the body of the sheep in the form of fleece is called shearing. This shearing does not hurt the sheep because the uppermost layer of the skin of the sheep is dead. Shearing of sheep is done in the hot weather of summer so that the sheep may survive without their protective coat of hair. The hair of sheep grow again before the onset of winter and protect them in cold weather. Next step is coating. What happens is the fleece of the sheep contains dust, dirt, dried sweat and grease etc. So the fleece must be cleaned before it can be processed into wool yarn. This process of washing the fleece that removes dust, dirt, dried sweat and grease is called scoring. Here what happens is that the hairs of the sheep are thoroughly cleaned by washing with soap and detergent and lots of water in the tank. We can see in the picture here. This process makes the fleece of the sheep clean and then it is dried. The third step in the production of wool is sorting. We know that the wool is not uniform in all the parts of the fleece of the sheep. Some parts of the fleece have fine hairs while others have coarse wool fibers. Also some parts have long wool fibers while other parts have short wool fibers. So the fleece of even same sheep has wool of different qualities. So the process of separating the fleece of sheep into sections according to the quality of the woolen fibers such as fine, coarse, long or short is called sorting. Now every section of the wool obtained after sorting contains the same quality of wool or the uniform wool after sorting. So the same quality wool obtained from the fleece of large number of sheep after sorting are mixed together. And now the process of dyeing starts. The natural fleece or the hair of the sheep or the goat is white or brown or black in color. This white woolen fiber obtained by sorting can be dyed in different colors. So we give different colors to it. Dye and give different colors to it. Next step comes combing. Combing is a method to prepare woolen fiber for spinning the yarn. This is done by using combs having metal teeth. The process of combing straightens the entangled woolen fiber and also removes the small fluffy, fluffy fibers from it. And lastly, the process of spinning is conducted. The long woolen fibers are spun into thick yarn called wool. This wool that is obtained from the long fibers are used for knitting, sweaters etc. And the short woolen fibers are spun into fine yarn which is used for making shawls. And then the woven, these uh, yarns are woven on a loom to make woolen clothes. Let us look at the occupational and the health hazards. 
Now, what happens is that the wool industry is an important source of livelihood for many people in our country. The people who do the job of sorting or separating the fleece of ship into fibers of different qualities are called sorters. The sorter's job is very risky because sometimes they get infected by the bacteria called anthrax which causes deadly blood disease called sorter's disease. The risk faced by people working in any industry due to the nature of the job is called occupational hazard. In woolen industry, sorter's disease is the occupational hazard for the workers working in this industry.